Right now we're going to take you outside to a live look at Ordway. So beautiful. I love these sunrise mornings. This is uh, powered by our VR Wireless Weather Network camera. You can really see that sun beaming in through the clouds there. Some pretty pastel colors here. Storm Tracker 13's Marty V with the latest. Good morning, Marty. Hey, good morning, Chris. That's some corpuscular rays out there. <laughs> Maybe a couple of rain shafts as well. It's looking pretty cloudy right now. Community Banks of Colorado here in Monument. There are some holes in the clouds, and occasionally we've seen the sun dancing through those holes, but right now more clouds than sun along the front range. Most areas are in the 60s. La Junta is a little warmer at 70 degrees, and it is a little bit humid out here across the plains this morning. We still have some 40s and 50s over the mountains and mountain valleys, and a few showers out there. We're not really expecting severe weather to be a great threat in the southern part of the state today. Maybe a couple of storms get close to severe criteria over northeastern Colorado. What we are expecting thing is some pockets of heavy rain and that's probably going to be our main concern particularly if any of the stronger storms interface with some of those local burn scars. Through noon I think we'll just have some lighter showers out there but uh, maybe about that time the first of the stronger showers should begin developing. They did that yesterday. No reason to think that won't happen again today and then they become more widespread as we move through the afternoon. Once again, you see some of the bright colors on the map, the yellows, the oranges, and the reds. There's a lot of water in the air, so any stronger showers and thunderstorms that develop will be capable of producing some heavy rain, and they'll be kind of slow moving. So it could get some good soakings today with some of these showers and thunderstorms. And because of the cloud cover and the added moisture in the air and the early onset of the showers, we're not going to get real warm. Mixture of 70s and lower 80s along the front range. A couple of spots on the far eastern plains might make a run at 90 degrees today, at least temporarily before the showers develop. We'll expect 60s and 70s over our local mountain areas and the southern valleys. And then we'll just continue watching the storms drift across the area through the evening hours. Futurecast is suggesting a good cluster of thunderstorms along the I-25 corridor by 6 o'clock. And again, you can't take this verbatim, but you see a lot of it out there and a lot of bright colors. So as I mentioned, good chances for some heavy rain. This stuff will propagate off to the east here through the evening hours. And then a little upper level circulation may keep some areas of rain going for much of the night over the southeastern part of the state. I think for most of the rest of us, things will gradually wind down here after midnight. But we'll probably continue with some pretty good cloud cover into tomorrow morning. When you wake up tomorrow morning, mostly 50s and 60s in eastern Colorado, we'll look for 40s and lower 50s up across the mountains and mountain valleys. So again, a lot of gray out there. You can see that from our camera at Highway 115 in Turkey Creek, looking off to the south across the Juniper Forest right now. And those clouds are going to keep that temperature under control today, so no heat really to worry about. And we get a pretty cool start to the work week the way it looks now as well. Later in the week, we'll dry things out, maybe not entirely, but enough to limit the thunderstorm coverages. And as you dry things out this time of year, you tend to warm up. So we're going to warm up, so we're not going to stick in the 70s for too long this time of year. So enjoy it while you can. Yes, we will. And no crepuscular clouds in uh, Turkey Creek. No, not in Turkey <laughs> Creek. Got to get that sun shining through there just right to see those. But those are pretty cool when you do see so them. So crepuscular. They're called crepuscular, crepuscular rays. It looks like you just call them the rays, the okay. sun rays that you can see. No, I want to call them crepuscular, crepuscular when I see you. Yeah, yeah, I, I will do some that. Some fun, yeah. fun uh, terminology: of crepuscular rays, Kelvin Helmholtz instability rays, all the kind of weather okay. goofy, you know, yeah. nerdy stuff. You got the scientists over here, all yeah, right. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, thanks, Marty. <laughs>